I think the things that the UK livestock industry can do in terms of providing good and healthy, safe food to people in the UK, one would be on, on the minerals, calcium in milk, iron in red meat. In terms of safe food, it is now safe to eat um, runny eggs in pregnancy, largely because of the work that the egg industry has done. The poultry industry are, are working on controlling Campylobacter, although much of that really comes in the kitchen rather than in, in the production anyway. The other aspect on, on the healthy food, although livestock products are very good sources of very high quality protein, they supply lots of minerals, they supply many vitamins. There is an issue perhaps with the fat. They also tend to be quite high, relatively high in fat um, and some of that fat isn't the healthiest fat that you could have. There are two main things which the livestock industry in the UK can do. Across Europe, our single biggest dietary source of saturated fats does come from dairy products. But we can reduce the, fat content, the, the saturated fat content of, of milk. Um, it requires minor adjustments to the, the diet of the dairy cow. It can be done, and certainly work that we've done at Reading has advanced quite a lot our ability to reduce the saturated fat content of milk. And we're looking now to see what impact that actually would have on people consuming those products. The other, on the fatty acid story, the other class of fatty acids, which as a population we consume suboptimal amounts of, would be the long chain omega-3 or long chain N3 polyunsaturated fatty acids, the ones which you typically find in fish. And as a population, we don't consume anything like the, the recommended amount of fish, certainly of oily fish, but we do consume large amounts of chicken and, and also other poultry products. Um, the chicken, because we eat so much of it, and because the chicken is also quite amenable to sm small changes in its fatty acid composition, um, we can get quite reasonable amounts of long chain omega-3 polyunsaturated fatty acids into poultry products, particularly through the hen, because she is very good at taking a plant-based source, which we are very poor at then converting into the fatty acid that you're trying to get from the fish. The hen is actually quite good at taking that, turning it into the fatty acid that we want, and then very obligingly depositing it into the egg. So the egg can be a, a relatively rich source of those fatty acids. Mm -hmm.